Hey, what's up guys? Joe Gas here today with the review for you guys on Gusto for the iPad, the perfect FTP client. This is a great application for anyone who manages multiple websites and needs to have everything ordered in a beautiful interface right in front of them. It's $10 in the App Store and anyone should get it. So right now, as you can see, there's a grid with all the current FTP clients I have added. If you go to the top right corner of the screen, you can actually add your own FTP client. Once you have that, you could put the title, website, host, username, password, or select the path. Press the settings icon near your FTP thumbnail to edit your current settings on ones you already have added. You could edit that all or just remove it. So tap on the thumbnail to get started editing your website. As you can see, you're gonna need some files so you can create stuff or download some from your server. Press the middle button to download stuff already added onto your server. and click show transfers. Once you're here, you could select any file you want to edit. I'm going to select the index.html and click download. That will download to our local host so we could edit it right onto our iPad. Press open and you have this built-in editor that looks really nice. I'm going to open another file to show you tab connections. I'm going to edit my mailer and open that as well and as you can see it'll show in two different tabs where you could easily switch back and forth between file and file. Simply hold down on a tab for a popover display and you can close it. I don't need to edit that so I'm going to delete it. So I'm going to change my index to say hey what's up instead of hey thanks for stopping by. And once I'm done with my changes, I'm going to go back to my transfers, check in the index file, and click upload. And there you have it. It's going to ask me to replace because it already detects an index file in the local directory. And once that's over with, we could go to our site and notice that changes have taken place correctly. Well guys, that's it for today's review. Anyone who is interested in having multiple FTPs in one app definitely needs to get this. Thanks for watching and please comment, rate, and subscribe.